I really need actual ice skates. A Charlie and Lola story by Lauren Child. I have this little sister Lola. She is small and very funny. Today Lola is really excited. Look Charlie, we've got a letter. Dear Charlie and Lola, you remember we promised you some money so you could both buy scooters? Well, here it is. Scoot well, all our love, Granny and Grandpa. Yes, says Lola. And I say, I've wanted a scooter for ages. When we see Marv and Morton, I can't wait to tell them. We're getting scooters tomorrow. Great, says Marv. And my mum is taking us all to the new ice skating rink after school today. And Lola says, ooh, ice skating. At school, Lola says, Lotta, Lotta, are you coming ice skating with us today? And Lotta says, yes, yes, yes. I love ice skating. Morton says, so do I. Lola says, I'm going to do ice skating, ooh, and ice slipping, ice loop the looping, wee, ice twisting, whoa, and ice twirling. Look, says Lotta. Ooh, says Lola. Evie's got ice skates that are real, and I don't have any ice skates. Don't worry, Lola, says Evie. You can borrow ice skates when you get to the ice rink. But I really do think I need to have my own ice skates just like Evie, with shiny silvery bits on the bottom and ever so sparkly laces. At the ice rink, I say, come on Lola. And Lola says, it's wobbly. Look at me, says Marv. I can do stopping, says Morton. Ooh, careful, says Lola. Yes, careful, says Lotta. Look at Evie, says Lola. She can go backwardy, says Lotta. Yes, says Lola, backwardy. Marv says, I want to come again really soon. So do I, says Lotta. So do I, says Morton. You know, Charlie, I really do think I absolutely and extremely must have my own skates. But we're getting the scooters tomorrow with Dad, I say. And Lola says, I'm going to have real ice skates instead of the scooter, Charlie, because then I will be a very good and very twirlyish ice skaterer. I will be the best ice skaterer in the whole of the school. When we get home, I say, maybe you should have ice skating lessons first, in case you don't really want them after all. And Lola says, but I do really want them, Charlie. I really, really, really do. But Lola, what about that big red kite you really, really wanted, and that toy guitar that you really, really wanted and never ever really, really played, and that special lighting up yo-yo you really, really wanted. You'd better go and ask Dad. Dad said yes, Charlie. He said yes. Are you sure, Lola? And Lola says, absolutely Completely and extremely sure. Dad said, I must be very, very good and promise not to change my mind and that he doesn't want to find the skates in the bottom of the cupboard. The next day we see Marv and Morton. I say, like my new scooter? Marv says, yep. And Morton says, oops. Lola says, do you want to see my really, really new ice skates? And Morton says, they're good, Lola. And Lola says, I can't wait to do ice skating. At the ice rink, Lola says, oh, 
And Lotta says, Are your ice skates good, Lola? Lola says, Yes, it's just a little bit tricky at the moment, because, you see, they have never been on the ice before. And I say, Come on, hold my hand. Then Lola falls over. I don't want to have ice skates any more, Charlie. I say, you did really, really want ice skates. You just have to practice. And Lola says, maybe. The next time we go ice skating, Lola sees Morton fall off his scooter. Oh, says Morton, I don't think I like scootering very much. And Lola says, I don't think I am very keen on ice skating, actually. Do you think our dads would let us do swaps? And Morton says, they might. I'm a good scooterer, says Lola. I'm a really good ice skaterer, says Morton. Then Lola sees Evie, boing, boing, and says, Ooh, that looks fun.